Okay. Hi. This week uh, for grammar, we're going to learn about adjectives. There are different types of adjectives. So uh, in general, adjectives describe nouns. This week's adjectives are colors and numbers. Let's think about some adjectives that are colors and numbers. What colors do you see around you? And what objects are these colors? An object is a noun, right? You might be looking at your notebook, right? It's a red notebook. So now it's not just any, a, a notebook is a noun, it's a thing, but uh, you're describing it using an adjective, which is red, red notebook. Let's think about numbers as adjectives. Let's think about how many chairs do you see around you? Yeah. I see two chairs. What about you? Chairs is also a noun. Chairs uh, is a thing, like an object. Remember, an, uh, a noun is a person, place, or thing. Right? So let's allow you some... Let's describe nouns and colors. So we have a list here of nouns, sky, grass, flag, mouse, and hair. Now let's use some adjectives, color adjectives, to describe it. The sky. What color is the sky? Blue. And let's put it together. I see, let's write a sentence, I see a blue sky. What about grass? What color do you see the grass is? Green. I walk on a green grass. What color flags do you see? I see an American flag on my desk. So my flag is red, white, and blue. So I'm going to write on my desk, I have a red, white, and blue flag. Oops. And I also forgot to do a space between my red and white and a comma. And the mouse. So you could talk about the mouse that runs around the house or the mouse that you use for your laptop. Let's all pretend we use the mouse that runs around the house. What color is that mouse? Gray. I see a gray mouse. Or you could think about Mickey Mouse, you know? He's like black and white with some red, right? And what color is your hair? I know some of you have blonde, dark brown, black, right? I'm going to write brown. I have brown hair. So these are some, in this center column, we see some adjectives that are in colors. And they're describing our nouns. And you can see that we can make, put it together and make sentences. Now let's look at some nouns that, this, uh, that we could use. I mean, um... We could use adjectives, numbers, to describe some of these nouns. Like we uh, like earlier, we tried with chairs. Like how many chairs do we see? Let's pick a number. Usually in the kitchen, we have about four chairs, right? So in the kitchen, there are four chairs. So I could really rewrite this number in word form. Trees. How many trees do you see outside your house or the last time you went to the park? I'll say I see like about seven trees or I could write the word seven. Now we can write the number four. Seven. There are seven trees outside. And sometimes adjectives we want to know how many they are. How many houses are on your block? I wonder. I'm going to write there are 10. There are 
10 houses on my block. How many cups do you have in the kitchen? Ooh, what a challenge to count them all, right? Well, let's do, how many cups do you use to drink water? One, right? We call them use one cup at a time. I use one cup to drink water. And how many laptops do you have? Oh, I was supposed to use cups as many, but that's okay. Yeah, I have one laptop too. One. I use one laptop. Laptop for school. So this way we're going to talk about adjectives. Um, we are going to use them to describe nouns. We're going to use numbers and colors to describe our nouns. Like how many do we see and what color are our nouns, right? Have fun doing that.